I think I, I realized something when I was editing, because I, I do editing during, hold on, I move away from these people. I realized something when I was editing, like, um, when was I editing the other one? Uh, like about two days ago, I think it was, I was editing one of the streams, which included, um, the other DLC. The big mountain one, Old World Blues, and I realize this Christine is the one who owns the fucking silent sniper rifle. And I don't know why it blew my mind away, because I was like, I was like, no, they can't be the same. And I was, I had to go back and check, and I was like, they are the same. I can't fucking believe it. So the the one who makes me read a shit ton is the one who basically owns the silent sniper rifle. She... I don't know why it didn't, like, dawn to me at all, considering she talked about the BOS and everything, and even in the other DLC it said her BOS silence sniper rifle and everything. I guess we'll just roll on and talk to Elijah. Okay. Now that you survived the villa, I need to get to my position. You don't need me to hold your hand anymore. But I'll what if I want you to hold it? the transceivers to the villa. If I need to offer guidance, I will. Yay. What do you mean? Perhaps you think this is a simple robbery. A cheap casino heist. Yeah, I was hoping so. Use your team as I use you. Listen to your caller. Watch where you step. You are no use to me dead. Thanks, mate. A gala Why did you just call it a gala? What? <laughs> okay. What do you know about the gala event? The gala event is the Stop way <laughs> calling it that. <laughs> is he following me already or no? No. If it isn't the Why can't I get you to follow me? I need you to get to your gala event position. There you go. Maybe Dolph will obey you. I'm not as easily broken. Why are you so rude? Do I have to bring Dog out? <sighs> dog, back in the cage. Oh, well, he... There you go. What? That made... <laughs> that made him want to follow, apparently. What's my weapon? Ah, my poker. Oh wait. Now he's dead. <laughs> Kill this one before they call others. It's only a roach, calm down. Nope. Oh you bitch. I didn't realize he was throwing nips. Oh for god's sake, I don't want to engage in battle. Me 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 me. Shut up. I want to just Unlock this stupid thing. For God's sake. <sighs> I'm gonna be here a while. I'm in danger, apparently. Come around this corner, I dare you. <laughs> I just say, come around this corner, I dare you, and then I'm just like, back to the terminal. Blanco mac and cheese, my favorite. One of them's over here somewhere. Where is it? Move! Ow! Good job, God. What, uh, weird thing is, with hacking... Where did... Wait, where did he just come from? I just looked at the chat and he just literally yeeted out of nowhere. Oh, Jesus, you scared the crap out of me. Um, do you know how to operate the switches? I do. The diagram. Well, I don't see a diagram because you talk to me and shit. Okay. Lore wise, yes, but I think it's more likely that a that a ghost wasn't dismembered. Of course I do that. Of course I fucking do that. Of course I do that. I lose him for two seconds and I'm already fucking hurting my kneecaps. Crackle fizzle boom. Wait, does that say boom with an N? 
Yep, that's boom with an N. I didn't know boom was spelt with N's now, but sure. <sighs> boop, 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 doop, boop, doop. Okay, there we go. That noise reminded me of what's it called? It reminds me of uh, Hades, that no noise does. Oh shit, that made me. Bruh. That made me throw it up because my thing freaked out. God friggin' damn it. I'm so glad I have great peripheral vision. Like, my peripheral vision is way better than my full fucking vision sometimes. I'm just so blind. <laughs> me two seconds ago. Let's actually get out of here. Also me. I want to explore. How the fuck did I miss this? How the fuck did I miss this? How did I miss this? I could have just walked up these stairs. Wow. Wow. I'm a genius, guys. Books. You fuck. I found a radio signal? Was it this one? Oh! It's Elijah! Throw it at his head! Bro, you're missing him! How are you missing him? Where's he at? Shakes her head slow. <laughs> All right, then. I'll just wallflower it over here. Wallflower? Oh my god, she's like that fucking bastard. Also, I realized chat does not want to show up again today. I want loot. I love how he just stops and smokes. He really reminds me of Hancock, not gonna lie. So it's a good thing- oh wait, give me this. It's a good thing I came back in here. To look for- Of course! Of course! This reminds me, I need to get back into Fallout 4 sometime. I think I found myself intimidated by the leveling system for some reason. I love the- Okay, yeah. Yeah, I clearly don't do either of those, mate. Let's not walk into that. Good job, Dean. <laughs> this is a funny scene. He's like, I can hear you moving wherever you are, and he's right there. Okay, some sort of weird cult things going on here. They have cool black candles. I want a black candle. Here is a bell tower in church to the north. <sighs> oh, those guards. What happened? Somebody something called you up or frowns and tilts her head slightly. Someone put you in there. Who bailed you out here? New guy? Interesting. Dean, are you hitting on Christine? You sure came a long way to rob this place. Guess greed is a bit lucky. Sure. <laughs> He wanted to go through there, but then apparently they just spotted us instantly. Oh, Jesus Christ, you scared the shit out of me, Dean. So let's see about creeping by the locals. 
I love how you say that, and yet karma kicks your ass instantly. I love how they always have sunglasses. The gold scaler area. Now so, make him stay. This is where I'm supposed to put on the show. Yep. Delayed better venues, let me tell you. What's that there? Wiring? Looks. Oh. Looks like it's tied to the sound system in the villa. Except for that snipped section there. So, what? I stand here, hold the two ends in my hands, and tap them together like symbols? Probably. I'm not gonna let any harm come to you. Really? That wasn't the we're both bomb married talk you gave me when we first met. Yeah, I know, I told you to go fuck yourself, basically. <laughs> so, where is it? Is it here? Where's the wiring? Oh! Wow, he's just got such an easy job. He has such an easy job. All he does, all he has to do is just stand there and hold those tiny two wires together. But, uh, how do I know the power won't suddenly go out and, I don't know, this still sounds risky to me. For me. Dean, a man with cold feet and someone I share a bed with. Wait. Hold on. I didn't say I was scared. <laughs> <laughs> Cold feet. Don't be ridiculous. I've played to worse crowds than this. I can hold the fort here. But listen. When this thing goes off, try and get it to the Sierra Madre without me. You'll wish you hadn't. <laughs> Have fun. So now is our dear friend Christine. And this also means a lot of reading! Oh no! Oh no... Oh no... She's so small! I love her, she's so small! She's me! I'm very small too. Wait. Her finger stabs through the red buttons, narrowing the local map. She scrolls the area... Uh, sorry, scrolls the... Bleh. I can't read, it's too much. Fucking hell. It said something about scrolling to the area of the Sierra Madre, and I didn't read the rest. She, uh, she goes up the local map of, of this place. Okay. She looks at you and points at the marker on the pit boy, and then points west and tilts her head. Uh, why do you think he wants you to go there? She frowns and makes a motion as if typing at the keys, and she points to you, raises her left wrist, and... I didn't see that word, what that word was. Points at you, looks at her left and right, raises two fingers and raises two type. Pauses. Oh, for fuck's sake. She's. It's so fast. I wish they'd give you more time. Christine scans the area. She seems on edge, checking the art. The arcades and arches for movement. She frowns. It looks upward and looks back at you. She nods her head upwards and makes the motion of holding a gun at the ready. In case she's ready to fight, basically. Whoa. Okay. Unless there's something over this way. I can't get it. Because it's uh, protected. Oh god, I'm gonna die, aren't I? Okay, uphold is not it. Shit, I'm about to die. Good thing for the save reminder. Approaches the edge of the catwalk. She turns away from the catwalk and begins looking around. What do you mean? You don't want to jump? Hello? Pretty easy. Hello? I just want to see if there's anything this way. And I fell. Yep. Remote maintenance passwords terminal. Is it this? Oh fuck. I fell. C Christine? Why aren't you coming? Why did I fall? That is the better question. Let's get going. 
I fell down again. Oh, I got it straight away. <laughs> oh, thank God. I got it rid of it. I would say what fell, and I ended up dying. Christine motions she points for the door uneasily, then makes a pulling motion with her hand. She seems hesitant to go near it. If you found a way to do a bypass from here, you should be able to just use the terminal over there. She nods gratefully and glances in the direction of the terminal, looks at you, smiles, and gives a thumbs up. Are you going to be okay here? She nods and gestures at your hand, offers hers. Take her hand. She holds it, meeting your eyes intently for a few moments. It gives you a hand a gentle squeeze, then releases it and smiles slightly. I'll be back I'll be back for you, okay? Tilts her head slightly and glances at your collar, then your pit boy, then she opens her mouth and then frowns and then closes it. Her face looks sad and she tapped her chest slowly. She nods at you and then at the exit. I mean it. Stay alive until I get back. She narrows her eyes determined and gives you one last nod. The bell tower. That's where you'll trigger the gale event. It's a ways up. I'm sure you'll find a way to climb up there. I mean, I kind of already did. Okay. Can you hear me? Hi. Damn transceivers. Let me link the callers to the speaker in the tower, then. There. Tap from the speaker. Speakers. What? I didn't read that. We're almost ready here. Single taps come from the speaker, then Ready's silence. The both of us. I'll keep Dog locked in his cage. You just open the Sierra Madre. What are we waiting for? Rubber Gideon? Strike up the battle already. Careful what you do. You think the villain's bad now? You haven't seen anything yet. Show's about to begin. People, take your places. Finally. Now, the gates will open. And so will the skies. Let's see this. Beautiful. You may not be able to return to the villa. Let's go. We all got knocked out. Where are my companions? So this is the Sierra Madre. Okay, I'm leaving, I'm leaving. Okay. I forgot they're hostile. I want to play roulette. It's currently closed. Ah. Bye. Ah oh, well. I was trying to do that, but I I suck at being in like F, um, the third person mode. I was like, I'm just gonna deactivate this right in front of you. <laughs> But I didn't get fast enough. Fuck you, bitch. And now I'm over in Cucumbered. Let's drink a bunch of wine, it's fine. Okay, can't go there. <laughs> Jesus Christ, that scared the crap out of me. <sighs> In each caller, to do that, you need to get close. Reset the signal, or blow their heads off. No! Leave the choice up to you. My preference, end them now. They're of no use. No. Where's Blackjack? Where's Blackjack? Where's my- I want to start my gambling addiction right now. Right here, right now. If you override the door lock, you won't be able to open it from the inside until you shut the gas valve and do dealt with dog. That idiot's opened the gas valves. A single spark, or he sets off his collar. The casino's going to burn. Us, along with him. Oh, shut off the God. gas valves, or that idiot will kill us all. No. Don't. 
Well, he's killed me too. I have no idea what I was looking for. <laughs> I've turned into literally nothing. I've turned into a toaster. Dog remembers. Oh. Left dog in cage. Mean to dog. Now dog. <sighs> They'll kill us both unless you do something. Never felt him so strong before. He won't listen to my voice. Dog can. What master wants, dog can do. This is sad. Not having you help doesn't matter if this heals you. Dog understands. Dog has done bad things. Knows why voice was furious with him. Tired of the anger. Thank you, Courier. Even if it's only for minutes before the Sierra Madre kills us all, then Dog hopes you find a way to save self like you help Dog. Aww. When you meet him, find a way to save yourself as you tried to save us. Otherwise, I'll be upset with you. I'll promise not uh, I'll promise not to try to get killed. You were there all the time. All the time. You were there and so close together. Who who are you? What is this place? <sighs> Thank you for whatever you have done. I will remain here. Need to get my strength back. I am your father. This gas is gonna kill me! For fuck's sake! Where's the last valve? Jesus. Oh fuck. I was about to make a joke, but I can't. The key slides out of. Okay. What? So you showed. Felt the clock <laughs> start kicking Bless me. as soon as the elevator doors rattled open. Think you're going to upstage me here at the Sierra Madre? I don't think so. Now that oh no, I Dean. So you're stabbing me in the back for the Sierra Madre? You think I'm the bad guy here? I'm not the one slapping bomb collars on innocent folks and flicking the switch. And I'm not stabbing you in the back. I was facing you all the time. This heist, I planned it lifetimes ago. You and that old man, tourists. Time for a little show. I'll just grab a seat and watch how this plays out from backstage. Security can handle it from here. <laughs> Black Widow. Come on, Dean. You turn me to ash. Hardly the way to end a beautiful partnership. It's a shame. I regret it. Still, you dames are all the same. Things get a little hot and get cold feet. That's why I'm still alive. You? Well, oh, come on. You're a terrible liar. See you soon. Where the hell are those stupid holograms already? Even if you get back here, you won't live long. Trust me. Want to bet? Empty, empty. Toy car, empty whiskey bottle, empty suitcase. Coffee pot. Kids tricycle for some fucking reason. An iron. Fucking mannequins! Stupid bitches. I don't have a chance to look here. Because they all need keys. Fucking keys! Give me. Move, move, move. Jesus Christ, I almost died. Hide here. <laughs> he can't see you from here, apparently. I saw her yesterday. When 
Oh! Wait! That's Dean? How dare he? I wanted to make a joke of... Ugh, chickens again. How the fuck did he get up there, actually? Oh, it's open now. Oh, Jesus! It's going to take a lot more than juggling keys and shooting speakers to stop me. Pew! I planned all this. I made it all happen. Not you. You stood there and I ran around, yeah, bitch. I had the key on me. I made other keys too to unlock the casino in ruin Sinclair finally. After all these years. No. Now Woof. Now I think ruining you and all your plans would be enough for me. Kill me, I still win. You're never getting in the vault. Oh, he's hostile! Can I not just not kill him? Bitch, you lied to me. Stop chasing me! Damn, I don't want him dead, though. I guess I just have to accept it. I'll get him on another run, then. Okay, well, I gotta kill him. I got no choice, which sucks. Oh, wait, now I've lost him. Where did he go? Sorry, mate, you're dead. Dean has died. Wait, what? I can't get to the door? Which door do I go to? What fucking door do you want me to go to? The other one. At least I got a- Oh, I got a nice dress! To let go. She doesn't look like she does anything. You? Sinclair? Sinclair, I'm trapped. Please. Sinclair. Oh, she does do stuff. Okay. Casino. I can hear the other guests screaming to be let out. To let go. Shit! You bitch! Fucking crazy bitch. Build a few targeting systems. Affirmative. Bye. Why do they turn into like ad actual animals? Ah! Stop shouting for Sinclair. Sinclair's dead. I've murdered him. Is Christine in here? So, you were the other person who escaped then. He knew Elijah how. No idea. A courier. Wore an old Ulysses. He was... I already have her dress. See? I've taken another one of her dresses. This is my new outfit. I look fabulous. I'll stab you in my dress. Never mind, I will die in my dress. And he dances on my body. Oh, and I explode. And you get a nice shot. <laughs> you have the last. Begin again. But no one to let you. I guess this is it. I'm about to die. I'm about to die. For two reasons. I just started reading that and next I was like, wait, I'm about to die. Wee into the void I go. Oh, I landed at the bottom of the map. Oh, <laughs> yo, I'm rich. If I take these gold bars, I will be way down. I want to read the personal accounts. I want to read the personal accounts. I want to read the personal accounts. I need to read the personal accounts. You. Oh, you bitch! Be more 
more traps down there. Another security system. Yeah, exactly. You're the mentor. That's what I was saying earlier from Helios 1. Veronica? She survived Helios? I'm just gonna say that. I know that. Their days were numbered since they occupied Hoover Dam. Ah. Wait, what? It didn't come through that, it just came back as a normal voice. What do you want from the Sierra Madre? What do I want? Weapons. Security. He wants a citadel of citadel his own. Of course he does. The Madre is all these things. It's a fortress. A weapon. A chance to begin again. Once I unlock its archives, I can carve the Mojave into any shape I choose. Okay, I'm just gonna say this because I want to read the thing. Mom called you doing okay. That's good. Look, I don't care. I don't care. No, I can't get in it. Staying in the vault. Think it'll protect you? No. I don't think so. I'll have the same I want to read this. Did you really think you could steal from me? I wanted to read the thing. What just happened? I wanted to read what the thingy was. Yes. I want to read this. Dean, if you are reading this, this is goodbye. You will have many years to read this message. Why? Uh, why you have smiled in my face and held a dagger to me. I do not know. You were rich, respected, even admired, loved by many. When you finally pass away down here, either by your own hand or, st or starvation, know that your greed has led you here for no reason I can understand. You have made a habit of using others for your own ends. Now the Sierra Madre is your reward. Whether you use blackmail or force, or even played via uh, to Vieira's greed, it will not help down here in the vault. Greed has led you here. I hope it leaves you empty as, it, as you left me. The door has been sealed. The elevator has left. Even Vieira's voice will not unlock it. N uh, no, that night on, of the gala event, I shall raise my glass and whisper, Fortunato. Fortunato. Rest in peace. I don't know what that says. Frederick Sinclair. The courier. Lured by the promise <laughs> of the Sierra Madre, could not escape. Once inside the vault, the casino did not let go. When the courier finally passed away, the casino created a new hologram to walk with the other ghosts that filled its casino. It was a pre-programmed homage intended for another. It assumed a new meaning in the likeness of the courier. I died. A means of allowing even the dead to begin again. Wow. Oh, you hear my body flop. It did. If you, if you secure that, that's all you want. No, there's one last thing I want from the Sierra Madre. It's bounty. The machines that fill its streets, its corridors. They provide, provide almost anything. Perhaps in the pre-war era, they were. I'm a little teapot, short and tall. Here is my never gonna give you up, never gonna let you down. Oh never my God! Not another one. You. Why does everyone love Rick Rolling in the chat? So where's he? Oh, jeez, hi! Oh, Jesus, okay. Wow. Nope, they're still hostile. Oh, shit! Hello! Okay, you came out of nowhere. Why? Cash out. Give me your stuff. I'm over in cucumber. Oh, my, my collar's about to explode. Oh, this is very bad. Path leads from the Sierra Madre back to the Mojave Wasteland. You're certain you'll never be able to get back here. Are you sure you want to leave? Yeah. You've heard stories of the Sierra Give me the story. Casino. We all have. This story's... 
different than the others. It's all in promise of beginnings and the end. Dog forgot himself, as did yeah. the voice that raged within him. After their passing, a new voice spoke within the mutant shell. It was difficult for the voice to remember the two it once was. There was the beast, Dog, consumed by hunger, and the other in reverse. The one consumed by control. Both were driven by need <laughs> for the other. The courier brought them together somehow. Joined the two into one. Aww. All that happened Thanks to come, let's go! Was a faint memory to the new personality. Like a flickering light in the clouds of the mind. The new voice did not think of the courier again until the battle of the divide reached his ears. Oh? The battle between the two couriers. Beneath the torn skies and the old world flag. Each bearing a message for the other. And the mutant prayed the courier that had saved him had been saved in return. Dean Domino. Entertainer. Singer. Thief. At his last show on the Sierra Madre stage. Yep. The heist he spent over 200 years planning. <sighs> just as the first by underestimating his partner's strength not long after the courier left the villa the lights in the theater shut off one by one that's Only sad Dean's hologram remained on the stage singing silently to an empty room still as consumed as he had been with its riches and ruin the Sierra Madre had held him captive long ago. Christine, her mission complete. Found new purpose as the Sierra Madre's warden. She watched over it silently. By choice. Over time, the ghost people came to see her as one of the holograms. They would watch silently as she walked among them. At times, Christine thought of the courier. Who had kept Elijah's hand from her throat. The courier reminded her of the other courier she had met in the Big Empty, and wondered if the two had found each other at last. She did not think of them again until she heard the legends of the Divide. The Divide, where the two messengers, the two couriers, fought beneath an ancient flag at the edge of the world. You heard of the Sierra Madre Casino. We all have. The legend, the curses, some foolishness about it lying in the middle of a city of dead, a city of ghosts, buried beneath a blood red cloud, a bright shining monument luring treasure hunters to their doom, an illusion that you can begin again, change your fortune. That's not the hard part. It's letting go. Wow. Wait a moment. Before you go. Oh. I... We... Hope you've enjoyed your stay. Farewells can be a time of sadness. Letting go... Difficult. As a guest of the Sierra Madre, you know that truth more than anyone. Frederick Sinclair believed one's life could be made anew every day. That fortunes were more than the wealth in your hands. Love. Life. Family. Those to care for. And those who will care for you. To those who know these joys, the Sierra Madre holds little they don't already have. Out in the world. Beyond the Madre and I will hold you 